رمضان تجلى وابتسم طوبى للعبد إذا تنمى What is the best food to have in iftar and sahur to keep you uh, to keep your energy rolling through the day? We don't have anything like that. The only prescribed food that was recommended by the Prophet ﷺ is dates and milk. See, with all food, the Prophet ﷺ used to praise Allah, makes hamd after eating it and asks Allah for blessing, except with milk. He would praise Allah Azza wa and ask Allah for more. وَزِدْنَا مِنْهُ And add more to us from it. So the food, everything else, Alhamdulillah, may Allah bless it and it's good. May Allah Azza wa Jal uh, bless the food we had. But when it's milk, the Prophet used to say, Alhamdulillah, O oh Allah bless it and add more of it to us. So milk is something that is highly nutritious. That is something that we should all include in our diet. And the Prophet ﷺ used to love it, used to consume it, drink it. So many hadiths. As for the dates, the Prophet said ﷺ, any household that does not have dates, the family living in that house are starving. Yes, but we have meat, we have vegetables, we have fruit. If you do not have dates, you are actually starving. And dates is the father of all food that you can live on it because it has all what you need. So milk and dates are the best. But we don't have anything else to restrict it. So if you would like, for example, to eat something else, eat some biryani, eat some halima, or halim, the, the dish known in, in Pakistan, there's no problem in that, none whatsoever. <laughs>